The Center for Sustainable Solutions came about because of the university wanting to respond to the climate emergency. It is a place where we can bring some of these existing practices and resources together and ensure the research that's happening in sustainability be applied to operations and professional services to the way that we focus our teaching and learning. So when we talk about climate emergency, we use language like urgency, like crisis. When we use that kind of language, we end up with people feeling sort of paralyzed. And so the center wants to be able to enable people to recognize that they can become part of the solution. It's about trying to provide the awareness and the resources for people to make different decisions or make conscious decisions. We're constantly trying to break down barriers and break down silos that exist within the university in terms of interacting across disciplines and also outside of the university. So the leadership team that we've brought together has representatives across the student body, it has representatives across our professional service staff. I'm the sustainability manager and it's kind of my role at university to help with developing environmental strategies and action plans. The other aspect of my role is around engaging with staff and students with respect to sustainability on campus and work very closely with a team of students. So we have a team called Guest, students that we employ on a part-time flexible basis during term time to promote sustainability on campus. And it was them that really had the vision for the community gardens in the first place. They've got lots of amazing ideas, you know, ideas around waste management, you know, biodiversity type projects, community engagement projects. It's almost worth starting with the process that we went through in terms of pulling together our climate change strategy actually. Making sure that staff and students were involved in that process from, from the get-go was really important. As a university, there is a border between the university and the applied field of the rest of the world. The importance of partnerships is to recognise that the only way that our work is relevant is if we're doing it in participatory partnerships with those other places to provide a really stable bridge between the research partnerships and other initiatives in the university like teaching programs, like professional services. So the centre is going to be working with and is working with communities across Glasgow. We're working with Glasgow City Council and with C40 cities to shape the vision both of where we want to go and how we actually get there. So the centre opens up a network. Just knowing who's out there in the academic community and what expertise exists is frankly amazing. So we want to keep reaching out to more and more people to enable individuals to understand what changes they can make. You know, our planet is, is so important. We get so much from it and nature is so important. I think that kind of underlies everything that we do, is just really valuing all of these natural things that are around us.